Well, I'm Buffy Rutledge Calhoun meeting. Yeah, I'm uh, Hunter Hines. I'm a, a restaurateur. Uh, my name's Tommy, and uh, I prefer just to keep it that. Um, would you like my given name or my chosen name? My people are from way, way, way back in Charleston, the original meetings in town. Uh, my friends call me Rooster. You're welcome to call me Tommy or Rooster. I am a small business owner, and I knew when I heard about the Spark Awards, it was the talk of the town, and I knew I just had to apply. Our restaurant is a new concept. It's a slow food, fast movement. I am at one with the world. Thank you. I'm the best mechanic at a well-known automotive dealership here, and I'm not going to say who it is. We bring singles together and help find that spark. All meals take at least an hour, and you prepare it yourself. Hula hooping, yoga classes, Pilates, and chanting. You come there and get your car worked on, not get a rose. <laughs> you know what I'm saying. I did some fact checking on my own and discovered the Spark Awards and I thought, ain't nobody got more spark than this guy right here. I just feel like it's finally time to honor me. I think that all little business deserves some recognition for our work in the community, bringing lovers together. Bringing people food is one thing, but making them part of the food experience is another. I'm gonna be flat out honest with you. Everybody knows our work from our marketing and advertising, and if you're going to judge it, you, woo, you just better think again. If you don't celebrate yourself, who will? I'll fight you for it. You want to fight? I'll fight. I ain't scared, dude. I think we've got the best spark in Charleston. I'm confident about that. There is no more important spark than the spark of love. And if we didn't have that spark of love, well, we'd be stink. And we wouldn't want that to happen now. ISIS would take over. Hell yeah, I'll be there. You got an open bar? I, I never pass up an open bar. And celebrating creativity in our community is so important. I'm always available for any occasion that has a lot of alcohol for free. There are two things my daddy told me. Don't believe anything you hear, only half what you see, and never pass up an open bar. And really, really attractive people here in Charleston. Here you're gonna have a lot of young creative people. I will be there. <laughs> Am I right? Open bar, done and done. <laughs> this is Charleston. I'm pretty sure there are gonna be some nice looking ladies there. And I know it's hard to believe, but I've been single now for 10 years. Uh, ten, we, I, I, let's just say the marriage ended, okay? And I'm single, and I had, a ladies are looking for love. Come see me. Don't miss that y'all. <laughs>